Area 51. Sonic Crazy Wheels. Yeah. Take one. Thank you. Hi, it's Richie and Abe. Ah! Now take one. Thanks. Oh. It's got to warm us up. <laughs> Hi, it's Richie and Abe in the Sonic Dad studio to bring you another preview of the next project. Howdy, folks. So, uh, I helped my son with a, a physics project not too long ago. He had to come up with a car that you wound something up, and, and then there would be a contest to see how many feet it would go. So I kicked around a couple of ideas with them. We've used this uh, little device. It's a badge retractor. We mm -hmm. use this on the paddle boat, yep. if you remember. We also, this is good for when you want your ninja stars to return. Oh, yeah, right I've never tried you. Right here. Don't lose them. Yeah. So I gave Patrick a couple of ideas for building a car with a battery tractor, and that got me thinking about different kinds of vehicles that you could use this battery tractor for. So I uh, started playing with an idea of stacking three of them with some washers in between, and oh putting that little kinetic energy engine in between two wheels. So the mass stays at the bottom and you wind it up and it rolls the wheels. So That's you. played around with a couple of ideas and uh, came up with this. I call it Sonic Crazy Wheels. <laughs> Very cool. There's a couple of different ways to, uh, to wind it. I'll show you here. This is one of the prototypes. You can grab the wheel like this and spin it around. Or you can wind it with your finger. Or you can build a little winding key like this in the hole. This is probably better for smaller kids. All right, send it over. Now let me sh show you the. Here's the finished. So wait, this is the got finished uh, prototype here. So uh, it's made from a quarter-inch dowel. You use uh, jumbo popsicle sticks as the strut that the. Uh, little battery tractors are mounted on. Of course, uh, fender washers for the mass in between the battery tractors. And for the bearings, using uh, pop can pull tabs. Make a nice little bearing. Plus a refreshing beverage yeah, while you work. Right. And then of course, CDs for the wheels. So, let me wind this guy up here. Move some of this stuff. I'm gonna show you one of the Red tricks. Red Rover? You gonna catch it? Yeah. Okay. This is going to, this is just a prototype for our answer to the energy crisis. <laughs> we see an entire fleet of family vehicles based on this technology. You have to keep winding them up. It's hard to get the cars to go around. So, this will actually do a couple of tricks other than just rolling across the floor. I'm gonna show you. Now you are a break dancer, right? That's right. This thing can also break dance. You need a bigger surface. There it goes. Wow. Break dance. Nice. Okay, now so. Look, can I clarify? Yeah. When I was in the sixth grade, I was a break dancer. However, there's a move called the windmill. You can still do it. I can still do it. But I have to stretch out for about 25 minutes. And then I'm, I'm kind of done for a week. <laughs> and you're sore for a while. But my kids think I'm awesome. So, uh, along with the break dancing move, um, this also has another trick you can do. My favorite car, my dream car, is the Tesla Model S. It's an electric car. Mm -hmm. And I test drove one last year. It was really cool. When you let off the gas, it has regenerative braking. And uh, it sends that energy back into the battery. This kind of has regenerative braking too because the strings from the battery tractor are attached to the axle. So when it unwinds, then it starts to wind up the other way. So you can do a cool little trick. This is about, the CD is about four and a quarter inch in diameter, which means the circumference is close to 15 inches. Mm -hmm. So if you know how far away the ledge of death is. In this case, maybe. What you can do know. is know how far you wind it, right? And then it will stop itself. 
And if, you're, if you're really good at your math, you can get real. That'd be a fun edge. game, actually. Yeah, you don't want to kill it. <laughs> See who could get it the closest. <laughs> yeah. Without dying. So that's Project 67, Sonic Crazy Wheels. It's going to be a skill level three and about an hour build. I love it. This is going to be a fun one. And the, this would be great for a science project. Yeah, it would. So there are several graphics included in this project. You get the spirals and a couple of colors. And Where's I've also you? done, that one's not on there yet. I've also done some dragster tires, if you want to see actual tires on your crazy wheels. And of course, it comes. the project will come with all the cutting templates for cutting your popsicle sticks and laying it all out. So that's it. It's a good one. <laughs> Hope you enjoy it. It was a lot of fun putting it together. So, Until next time, I'm Richie with Sonic Dad. I'm Abe. Now it's your turn to go make something cool. Peace out. See you next time. Word up. God bless. And all that jazz. If you like what we're doing, click here to subscribe to our YouTube channel or click here to go to our website. Thank you. <laughs>